How's it going guys? Welcome to another episode of Spurverts. You know Spurverts, the show where we talk about everything that has us absolutely excited to be Spurs fans. I'm Craig Mitch and this is Reese James. Hello. You guys know that already. Anyway, let's get on with the show. So let's talk about the first uh, transfer that's happened. Toby Alderweireld. Yes, I pronounced it correctly. He told uh -huh. you to though. He uh -huh. told you how to in a video on Spurs official channel. So you had no excuse. True, true. Uh, Toby Alderweireld. So he signed five year deal, but more importantly, he's begun training. The preseason kicked off, uh, they're posting pictures of him on Instagram, balancing on balls, getting ready. Do you think he's going to be a good sign in this I think season? he's going to be great. I'm really, really happy that we actually definitely got him. It wasn't Spursy in the end. Mm. Southampton didn't snatch him from us with their lawyers. We yeah. actually got him and we're just firming up our defence. We just need a striker now yeah. and maybe a midfielder there was a bit of, maybe a goalkeeper. There was a bit of worry there because they said they might take legal action against us for it, but apparently they've dropped it because he kind of you know, initiated the deal. He said he wanted yeah. to go to Spurs. He was quite clear about that. Good, Toby. You're following yeah. Kevin Vimmer's stuff. You want to be like him. You've got to be more pro Spurs now. Change I'm all up your for Twitter that. banner. Get yourself on Flaming Text. You know what to do. <laughs> you know what to do. All right, let's talk about another potential uh, transfer that could be happening. Uh, Benjamin Stambouli. He can go. Kapu's gone to Watford. Stambouli apparently is linked with PSG. Would that be a, a bigger move for him? Do you think PSG's yeah, a bigger club than so us? Yeah, so I'm a bit confused with this. He's linked with PSG. G, but also, Squawker is saying that the Watford deal is done. 5.5 million, he's definitely gone. Terms have basically been agreed and he's going in the next two days. Yeah. But the Evening Standard are saying that's massively fallen through because he's going to PSG. So who, what source would you go with? I don't know. I don't trust anyone. Online that's my philosophy. source, newspaper. <laughs> okay, stick with your philosophy then. DTA, don't trust anyone. Would you want him to stay? I wouldn't mind. He's a good uh, squad player. Hasn't really been given a chance. Wouldn't mind keeping him. All right, all right. Let's move on to our but next one. I wouldn't mind taking six, seven million for him. That's a nice little fee. Yeah. Why not? All right, let's move on to our next one. Emmanuel Adebayor. We speak about this guy he so much go. here. For the wrong reasons. He's got one year left on his contract. We're paying him way too much money. And uh, apparently he's linked with Aston Villa. Tim Sherwood wants him back. And uh, we'll salute to that. You can go, Adebayor. Go. Uh, he's also posted a video on his Instagram yeah. doing a little dance. Like... Yeah, little hip movement, and he's got a little fella next to him. You and, know uh, that you're not, you can't be seen from the waist down, so all of that. <laughs> um, he was wearing like Spurs shorts. Do you think yeah. he's trying to pull a Bentley there and kind of show yeah, I'm he still is. here? I do think he is. I think he is trying to show Spurs fans that he likes us, but yeah. he... Because he keeps saying, oh, I'm pumped for the next season and I'm really going to try my best this year. It's, it's too late. It's we too can, late, We Emmanuel. can see through it, Emmanuel, okay? Manny, or whatever you prefer to be called. All right, we're going to go on to our... Hashtags were mad in that video. Yeah, yeah, what were some of them? Just, you know, get through it. Stuff get like through that. it. You get through it. Get, <laughs> get through the bloody tube, mate. And get off to a different team. QPR. Go. All right, let's talk about the last transfer, uh, potentially, and it's Kevin Morales. So, yes. we're linked with him, another Belgium yeah. brother. Come, join the brotherhood. It's going on over here at Spurs. We're just going to take all of you Belgian players, Benteke or next. Apparently, uh, we're going to link him with Aaron Lennon. Give them Aaron Lennon a bit of money. Yeah, take that's fine. Could you do that? Yeah, Lennon's not Belgian. What used to he to us? Yeah, he's not Belgium, uh, but apparently they're, they're similar age. So, how old's Kevin Morales? Off camera? 29? 29? 29. 29. 29. Take him? I'd take him, yeah, I'd take it. If, he's, if it's a straight swap, yeah. or maybe like a little bit of Lennon plus a bit of cash, but not much, I'd take him. Especially if we're getting money for Stambouli. Morales would be a good signing for us, I think. So, Kevin, come on, join your brother Toby over here. We can get this bromance started. And that's been Smurvers. Uh, make sure you leave a comment below and keep an eye out for part two. It's coming soon. I've been Craig Mitch. This is Reese James. This is part two of Smurvers. Uh, I'm Reese James. I'm here with Craig Much. Am I saying that right? No, you're not. Well, Let's see what they say in the comments. Anyway, this week we are extremely excited about the new stadium.